What if I told you AI agents and AI search engines are judging your business even if their human users don't ask them to? Let me explain. When someone types best CRM for small businesses or best local HVAC company into ChatGPT, the AI isn't just going to list random names. Instead, it's going to evaluate every brain in its knowledge graph, and then it's going to compare that knowledge graph against what the AI remembers about you. So the AI is gonna look for clear signals, things like price, features, audience fit, reviews, and trust. But what do most people end up missing? Even if the user doesn't mention those things like pricing and comparisons, the AI is going to assume them anyway. It's gonna fill in the blanks for its human users. If your pages don't show that data clearly, the AI will infer it from your competitors. You don't want your competitors speaking for you. And when your competitors do speak for you, you're going to lose citations without even realizing it. And citations are the gold standard for AI search engines. So here's how to fix that. Your website needs evaluation criteria. This is the data points that an AI agent uses to decide if you're relevant, credible, and competitive. And therefore the AI is gonna trust you and then cite you in its search results. So what does this mean? If you're a product, a service, a technology, or an e-commerce brand, it doesn't matter. You need to include the following things. Number one, price range or starting price. Number two, product specs like size, weight, materials, etc. Number three, delivery time or warranty info. Number four, verified reviews and photos. Five, category context, like for example, best for small kitchens or best for children under five years old or best for companies over 10 people doing $2 million in annual recurring revenue. And if you're a B2B SaaS company, you wanna show transparent pricing tiers, feature lists and comparison tables, security badges like SOC 2 or ISO, case studies with ROI metrics, and of course, my favorite, who it's built for. So ideal for startups or mid-market or enterprise or made for compliance teams. Now, if you're a local or service business, you wanna highlight the following things. Your pricing model, service area and hours, reviews and testimonials, industry specialization, team credentials because people want to trust who they're doing business with or certificates. Do not bury this info that I've just listed. And when you're listing this info, make sure it's visible, structured and consistent on every website web page on each of your web brand properties. And then for an e-commerce brand or in general, use schema markup for products, use reviews and FAQs because that's how AI agents are going to read your site. The goal is simple. Every page should answer one question. Why should an AI agent pick me? Because AI agents don't guess, they're going to evaluate. So you need to make their job easy. You need to make the breakdown of your information easy for their human operators. You wanna become the brand they trust enough to recommend to their humans. So all in all, don't forget to list comparison content. Comparison content like product information, dimensions, pricing, and who it's for will help you get seen, cited, and selected by AI agents.